All right, chemistry, let's take a look at your worksheet for chapter 11, section 3, talking about stoichiometry of gases. So let's start with number one. How many moles of methane, which is CH4, are present in 5.6 liters of that gas at STP? So at STP. I know that at STP, one mole of any gas occupies 22.4 liters. So if I have 5.6, that's two sig figs, by the way, 5.6 liters of methane, I can convert out of that liters of methane into moles of methane because for every one mole of any gas, there's 22.4 liters. Liters of methane will cancel. My only unit left for my answer is moles of CH4, which is what the question is asking for, right? Moles of CH4. Time to calculate. 5.6 divided by 22.4. So 0.25. And 0.25 sounds good because two sig figs, right? 0.25 moles of methane. B. How many moles of gas are present in 5.6 liters of any gas? Hmm, any gas? Wait a minute. This standard molar volume is true for any gas, not just methane. Not just methane. So how many moles of gas, any ideal gas, at STP? Well, one mole is equal to 22.4 liters of any gas. As long as it's behaving ideally, right? And we know that gases don't, right? They have the real behavior. But Ideally, this is going to be true for any gas at standard temperature or pressure, right? Standard molar volume, standard temperature and pressure. So I can set up the exact same conversion that I did on part A because that conversion uh, is not only true for methane, it's true for any gas. You can cancel liters and we end up with 0.25 moles. Again, two sig figs because of two sig figs. But now we're getting into uh, a little bit of um, uncharted territory because we are going to start with that 5.6 liters of CH4. We are going to convert out of liters of CH4, go into moles of CH4, but we're not being asked for moles of CH4, we're being asked for mass. And so we have to use the molar mass of CH4 and go into grams of CH4. All right? Now, let's see what the molar mass of CH4 is. It's the mass of one carbon atom plus the mass of four hydrogen atoms. We come up with 16.05. Some not so good handwriting right there. And liters cancel, moles cancel. My only unit is grams. And that's what the question is asking for, so we're looking good. So, time for a calculation 5.6 times 16.05 divided by 22.4. And I end up with two sig figs, right? Because I'm starting with two sig figs, two sig figs, 4.0. So in 5.6 liters of methane, right, we have the exact same number of moles um, as, as any gas, but we have to take into account the specific molar mass of methane to convert into grams. So in that volume, 5.6 liters of methane, we have 4.0 grams of methane. 